88.2. I'm not up to temp yet. Probably should leave me in the oven a little while longer before you start the curing timer. So how can we tell that part is properly cured? Well, one, the first thing we want to do is check the tech data sheet slash application guide uh, on the website. That will give you the cure schedule, time, and temperature. Now that is in, that's based off of uh, part temperature, so that's very important to know. Because to know what your part temperature is, you're going to need one of these. This is a uh, IR thermometer temp gun. Simply crack the oven open, shoot the part, see what the temperature is. If it is not up to temperature, then you don't want to start the curing timer yet. Oftentimes people think that once the powder is flowed out, it's up to temperature, but that's not the case. Powder will flow at a much lower temperature than the actual curing temperature, so you want to make sure and know the difference. It's also common for people to use temperature probes to try to gauge the temperature of a part, but those aren't always accurate because they also gauge the ambient air temperature of that region of the oven, not solely part temperature. Now to review, we need to check the tech data sheet for the cure schedule, and then we need to be able to check the part temp for the proper temperature before we start the timer. It's time.